Well, dogs displaced by Hurricane Michael are getting a second chance right in our backyard. The coast to coast trip thanks to the San Diego Humane Society. And our tennis reporter Travis Rice was at Gillespie Field when the plane load of dogs touched down from Florida. Just a few weeks after Hurricane Michael destroyed their home, dozens of dogs have a new home here in San Diego. It's a six hour flight with barking, but it's certainly better than the aftermath of a hurricane. These are dogs that were already in the shelter when Hurricane Michael hit. 93 dogs from Panama City Beach are now in San Diego looking for a new home. They were already available for adoption or almost available for adoption. They are not animals that have been displaced by the the storm, so they are not, they don't have owners that would be looking for them. Kelly Shry with the Humane Society says these canines may not have survived if they stayed back in Florida. These are shelters that have also been affected by the hurricane. They are out of power. They have damage from flooding and wind, so they are in need of the support to get some animals out and on the path for adoption. They still need to be spayed, neutered, and microchipped before they're officially up for adoption, but there are plenty of people ready to care for them now. The Humane Society says it should be about two weeks before all of the animals will be able to be properly adopted once they get their shots and other sort of veterinary matters. In Gillespie Field, Travis Rice, 10 News. A lot of puppies there. The Humane Society says they expect this to be the only round of dogs sent here for now.